We're back on the mm-hmm. chef, you and I, with Marty Schultes and myself, Catherine Raker. Mm-hmm. And you know, I used to live overseas in Singapore, but mm-hmm. I've never seen a bubble waffle maker. I- I, I have never seen one like this either. And they say it's uh, popular in Hong Kong. So, right. um, how do we know? Yeah, we'll so give it a try. We actually are going to give you the recipe and it's going to mm-hmm. be up on our website. So, let me give you the recipe. And it's really easy it's three egg yolks, three fourths of a cup of milk, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, six tablespoons of unsalted butter melted, three quarters of a cup of sugar, one and a quarter cups of cake flour, one and a half teaspoons of baking powder. A pinch of grated nutmeg, and that's optional, and an eighth of a teaspoon of salt, and six egg whites beaten to medium peaks, right? Mm -hmm. So in a bowl, you whisk together your egg yolks, milk, vanilla, butter, sugar, until it combines. In a large bowl, sift the flour, baking powder, nutmeg, and salt. Whisk the egg yolk mix into the flour mixture until it's well combined and no lumps remain. Add one-third of the egg whites to the batter and stir until lightened. Gently fold in the remaining egg whites in two additions. And we've already preheat the iron, and we're going to pour the batter oh, evenly, see. right? And this is not like your regular waffle maker. This no. looks like it's going to take take some battery into it because yes, definitely. It's, um, it's almost got a honeycomb type of shape to it. So. Yeah, and see, there's a lot of these holes, Marty. Yeah, we want to get that so all filled So we want to get that in there. Hold on. So it's not like anything you've ever done before, mm-hmm. right? So they want you to do it evenly through all the holes. All right, hold on. This is going to be fun. I'm wondering mm-hmm, what mm-hmm. the kids are going to, your kids are going to think. Or oh, your... something, something different and neat, you know? Yeah. Okay, I'm getting, getting there. Almost there, yeah. We're almost there. You don't want to rush it, right? I want to kind of move it around. There we go. And right or not? I don't yeah. know. Well, this is the first one. Well, we'll see how it all. We'll goes. see how it all yeah. goes in a minute. All right. So it looks like we almost got it all filled up. We and do. then we're going to close it up. Okay, we're going to close and, it up. You know, and with, with any other waffle maker, we're going to wait till the steam quits coming out for it to let us know that it's done. Okay. You and you have to hold it together and push it yep. like that. There we go. And usually with waffle makers, as you know, they come out the side. So I'm going to get a couple of paper towels. <laughs> and it said, Marty, actually three mm-hmm. to five minutes for it to bake. Mm-hmm. And what we've done. Oh, wow. Maybe I put too much in there, Marty. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll find out. <laughs> we'll find out in just a minute, right? And it said evenly. So let yeah. me do this. More to just top later. Right. So I see, Kath, you've already got your toppings out already. You've got some, looks like whipped cream and berries and strawberries. Oh, right. who doesn't love that with waffles? Yum. Oh, my gosh. Mm. Well, you know, it showed it on the box, uh, mm. the Procina, um, Cucina Pro Maker. It, it showed it like that. Mm. And, it, and actually, you can see it right there. And it shows you that it looks like you put two different ones mm. and, and make... Those beautiful fruits in together. Yeah. You Isn't almost that pretty? hold it up and eat it like a sandwich. Yeah, like a sandwich. <laughs> awesome. A waffle sandwich. That would be great. You know, when I yeah. was down south, I had waffles and fried chicken. Right. That is delicious. Oh, I that know. That is delicious. I know. So. That's not a diet, though, unfortunately. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it was good. It I was really good. I've never had it before. And, so. you know, it's funny that mm. every once in a while, I have to have a waffle. Mm. Don't you? I like waffles. Yep. And we do it for dinner sometimes. And Mm. I want to show you this, Marty. This is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful. And so, and if you want to do something different for your family, especially in the Mm wintertime, because you get tired of really heavy meals sometimes, Mm -hmm. and you just want something a little lighter, but Mm -hmm. you could have um, some... You know, sausage with it. You could have ham. Mm. You, we're going to have this for dinner tonight. So yeah. I'm pretty excited about this. Yeah. Who doesn't like breakfast for dinner? I, I do. Don't, I do, too. And <laughs> having a long. nice cup of coffee, that sounds great. Oh, that sounds wonderful. So we're just going to take a short break, and we'll be right back on The Chef, You and I. All right.